Booyaka Shy, everybody. What's up? I'm Robert Artist, aka Otaku Baka. Yes, me. Otaku Baka leader. Yes, me. Okay, now, what I took, what I reminded the, yes, I said I was going to do the top five Killer Instinct Season 2, my top five Season 2 Killer Instinct characters. Now, um, if like, I do not know if you guys will like this or not, but if you will like this, leave a comment or leave a like, or subscribe, subscribe me anywhere. I will do this all day, every day, 24-7. Well, not 24-7, but I will, but I will soon in the future. But without further ado, let's get this five. Agonos. Yes, I think Agonos was one of the top five. Everybody be saying, like, this nigga is too big. He even, like, blocks the thing for art so, so that we can actually look at his at his thing of his thing. But you know. But but he actually can do a lot of stuff. He just gotta he just gotta look at his stuff. And he just gotta keep practicing for his stuff. And that's what I think. Number four is Sako. Yes, I picked her not because yeah, everybody thinks that she's slow. But this is what like my favorite part. You actually be a scary, a scary person, a scary character on one of the fighting games. That is very fucking cool. Even though that she's slow, but she is still powerful as hell. You can do all this shit with her, even when she's slow and she's a little bit bad, you can go behind the bitches and then you can just slash the bitches left to right. Number three. TJ combo. I think TJ Combo, even though he's an officer and he all and he got the robotic arm and all the tech, but still, I think that he's actually a very good person and he is actually good when you can actually just keep practicing practicing with his combo and then you just you get better and better and then you just like want to keep like going sit down for real. That's why I picked up for number number two. Okay, I put Riptor because he is just like that, uh, just like the actual Saber Wolf. And he is like, I think he's actually faster than Saber Wolf, but even with the uh, actual uh, combo, even Saber Wolf can even do it. He can't really be fucked, and then he is just like carrying the most of the net. And that's why I think he's actually like, he's like, let's get on to number one. Number one, Cinder. I picked Cinder because he is actually, to be honest, a kickboxer and made out of flame. And plus, I think he is also like a trapper, a trapper on, on, the, on the battlefield because he did trapper around the stage and he was, he was flicker and stuff. And I like that he is very fast and you can actually do an easy, easily godlike combo and just keep going and going with the ultra combo. So yeah, that's that's about it, everybody. Um, those are my top five favorite characters on season two, Killer Instinct. So, uh, do you guys like this? Do you guys know what you want to do? Le leave a like, leave a like, or subscribe my my channels. I will be doing this. Also, I will be doing more of this. I will be also putting up more information about Killer Instinct season three, about Raz, Kim Woo, Tusk, and Gargus. It, even more later on than that. So I gotta go without further ado. I am the Otaku Baka leader. And again, we're not idiots. We're otaku.